Yo guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. Today, I will be showing you how to complete Lundell's The Quest map. Now, this is sort of a parkour escape map. It is featured at this moment in our in the creative hub on Fortnite. So if you guys want to play that, make sure you go over to the creative hub. Or you, if you don't, uh, if it doesn't pop up for you, the code to this map will be in the description as always. Now, all you see me doing here in this clip will be I will begin the coins. I'm pretty sure I get most of the coins. I might have missed maybe one or two, which are which the ones are hidden. I don't know where they are. But I think I got most of them in this video, maybe around like seven, seven, eight. So that's pretty good. Um that is one of your challenges. So if you guys want season eight for free, um that is one of the challenges you need to do if you did not know that. So right here you just see me shooting a few bots in the distance. Well by a few I mean one. <clears throat> there was just one camping up there. I'm gonna run forward and collect another coin. And yeah, also, you will see me do a lot of shortcuts. So I know you need to complete this map without uh, using as much impulses as I did. But if you want the easiest way to actually complete this map, it's right here. I will show you literally every shortcut there is to this map. And you will probably skip, like, towards the end, I think you'll skip around maybe another three minutes, four minutes of parkour. So that's good. So you want to go down here in this hole and collect some impulses. So I, I mean right now I think we've collected three coins already. So that's pretty good. And we're about to get another one now here. I remember when I was recording this I failed a few times. But you, you'll see me get up uh, with my impulses. So I should really speed this part up. But let's make that video a little bit longer should we. I mean, usually it isn't, it's not this hard to get up, but I don't know why I was just failing. Like, usually you just want to land on that uh, metal pole, just like, yeah, like that. Just jump up, get the squin. As you saw on the top left, another one of my challenges are uh, almost completed. So you want to refill your impulses again, because you'll need quite a few um, if you want to complete this map. Um, I guess cheating. Well, you, you're you not really cheating because the map is giving you this. I think this is the easier version that um, Fortnite actually put in the game because I know uh, the creator himself, he's uh, made two maps of this, so he's made the easy version and then he made uh, a harder version with a lot more traps. But I think this is the easier version. Alright, so go down here. There'll be another boy to shoot. I'm not too sure why there, there's meant to be two more as well that spawn. I'm not too sure why they didn't spawn in this game, but it doesn't matter. You want to impulse up here on the corners like I just showed you. This one as well, collect some more Fortnite coins. And just impulse your way up here. Honestly, this map, I think half of the time what you'll be doing is impulsing. I'm not even lying to you. Like if you have a lot of impulses, you can complete this map really quickly. Like if you're not going for coins at all, I think you might be able to complete this map in maybe like four minutes, maybe five minutes if you're just speed running. But if you do go for coins, it takes a little bit longer. Just dodge these traps here, and usually I think I'm meant to jump up so that you hit the bouncer straight away. But just to be safe, um, just impulse. Whenever in doubt, just. Impulse your way up. Wait for him. Another coin. I think now we've added. I, I've lost count. I don't know how many coins I've collected already, but they do. So every time you um load in a new game in a creative game, they will respawn and count towards the challenges. I dropped a few impulses here, just in case you do die. So if you fall to the bottom, you'll just lose all your items. So I just dropped a few there, just in case. But it's all good though. So like I was saying. If you guys want to get your challenges completed, you can just do uh, get your coins in one game and then once you've collected them all, you can just restart the game and collect them again. That does work. I'm not sure if that is supposed to work like that because there is, I think, five featured islands right now. So, this is the new update, by the way. I would be playing uh, Apex Legends right now, but um, the servers are down for downtime right now, so I'm making a video for you guys. Oh yeah, by the way, if you haven't seen my yesterday's video, on Apex Legends, make sure you go check that out. I've got 50 pro tips for you guys to improve. I'm not too sure why you get pissed out of this chest. Honestly, it's not um not necessary. It is just there for no reason. 
So you're going to want to make these jumps up here. Like half of these jumps, um, they're just blocks that you can go through. So you're not actually going onto them. There is two ways to complete this. So now if I was to turn left, I could take another way. But this way is just a lot easier. You want to jump on uh, the deer's head. <clears throat> so yeah, that's the other way you would come from. But you don't need to do that. Right here, there's supposed to be a trap. Not too sure why I didn't spawn. As you can see, there's another one on the other side. Dodge that. Honestly, like, if you guys have completed um, Scissors Death Maze, not Death Maze, Death Runs. If you have completed Death Maze, you might, this might help you as well. But if you've completed his Death Runs, you will know how uh, how easy it is to actually do these maps now, the parkour ones especially. So you just want to gain some momentum on those boosters and then make your way here. Fall down. And now, I think I cut this part out. On the right side, there is going to be a car. And um, you're going to have to bounce your way to the furthest left door. But I just impulse stop. Like I said, another quick cheat right here. And uh, yeah, you just want to cheat that way too. Impulse up here. Now you've pretty much just skipped half. Not even half. Like, I think a quarter of the map remaining. Like, you've skipped a lot just by doing this one jump with the impulses. And you come down here. There will be another coin above you. You can I mean, I failed here in this clip, but that's the normal way to do it. But like I said, impulse. The easiest way. Now, this is the end of the map. I'm sure it is. Um, maybe there is some hidden door somewhere. But I did go up here. You see, you get a few chests with health. Unless there's another hidden secret area somewhere. I don't know like where the ending of the map is but guys if you did enjoy this video make sure you leave a like for more videos like this comment down below for any maps you want me to play or anything like that and yeah i will see you in the next video bye